Jason. What we have here is a uh, cordon train spur pruned uh, Zinfandel vine, uh, one block on the Bradford Mountain Estate Vineyard. Vines are um, planted uh, it's about 10 years ago. Uh, Zinfandel is a reasonably good vigor on this site. Um, assess the vine. The vigor looks uh, pretty good. If anything, perhaps the canes are a little bit longer than ideal. We haven't uh, irrigated this block in probably seven years, so um, I'll, I'll leave a few more buds this go around to keep the uh, vigor in check. Basically, we're going to take off about 98% of the new growth. You can see the trunk was trained up the stake, the cordons trained out on the wire, and about six to eight inches along the cordon, we have the spur positions. And what I'm gonna do is cut back from last year's two bud spur, cut back one of the shoots that grew. Typically the basil, the one closest to the old wood, will leave and uh, prune that back to two buds, so one, two buds. And this will give us the crop next year. You can see, even though it's just the beginning of February, the vines, because of this warm weather and the, the good rains, are already starting to bleed. That's the sap is starting to flow. So I'll continue. I think I'll prune some of these spurs, leave an extra bud to put a little more fruit on to keep the vigor a bit in check. Um, here we're going to violate the rule of choosing the basil, the one closest to the old wood, because the it's too close to the trunk and kind of in the way of um, sunlight, etc. So I'm going to prune off the basil and leave a two bud spur. Here I'm going to do the same thing. Go with the and making sure you have a good, uh, at least a hand width distance. And put the brush in the center and it gets chopped and then um, mulch back into the soil. Gives a little more organic matter to the vineyard. Cut the wire, so you got to be careful where you put your shears. And that's uh, got to get the brush out of the way, but that's pretty much uh, what a uh, proper uh, um, cordon train spur pruned vine. So we we'll end up with uh, here we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten spur positions. Ten to twelve is uh, uh, pretty typical for vines that are spaced uh, uh, five foot apart. 